Time to leave for China. Got my dream hat and my walking shoes and a perfectly organized bag. Here we come, Hong Kong and Macau. Headed to China on the longest flight ever. Like ever around the world or halfway around the world. Been up all night long and we are on, what is this, a subway? And yes, because the they told very, me we were very getting very a ferry, but stay. I'm like, this is, looks like a subway, not a ferry. <laughs> but now we're going to the ferry. We have Nashville people. There's Taylor and Sam and Dan and Marla and Samira. Like, how can this stuff even be real? Are you going to eat that? Oh, those are nuts. That's disgusting. <laughs> it looks like sardines. Okay, we're finally loading the ferry. I just don't know. Turbo jet. I don't know. I don't know. What is she saying? Like, totally Vegas. Yes. In China. That reminds me of, oh, that's Shopping Four Seasons. That reminds me of Caesar's Palace. Did you see the Sands Casino when we drove in? Yeah. Are you recording? I am. She had no idea what I was talking about. We're and here. Then she gave me directions. We're, we're here. here. Yay! We're here. Okay, so we're, look. Oh, like you open, you come through the door. I'm getting sidetracked. Look at how fun. Yay! So, we're on a mission to find a spot. Look at how cute. 11 o'clock here and everything is still open like we are just now eating dinner there's a grouper and I don't understand these like what are these look at this car what is this it's a freaking Porsche you've got Tiffany and company turning in the door. Like, what a concept. So here's EO Nashville navigating 20 people through a mall after dinner to Club Cubic. It's like getting together a herd of cats. It has been raining here all day long and we all look like drenched rats. Okay, so we're trying to herd people. Come on. Free lady drinks. Come on. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. We are opening the bar. I think, yeah, I think we're like Actually, two hours early. Or maybe even three. Look, look, maybe here. Even Eric's three. over there checking out the pole to see if it's going to work. Okay. I guess this is a major sponsor. There's the pole. Is it dirty? Yeah. Of course we're streaming this. How yeah. many people can we get in the elevator from Nashville? Everybody We're live streaming some stuff. Mary Poppins over here. Woo, Mary's back. <laughs> she has her umbrella. Okay, look how big it is. Look at this. Okay, and listen to me. No lines. It no is not Green Hills. Lines. 
So I'm in absolute heaven. That is the coolest Apple store I've ever seen in my life. Go line. And tomorrow I'm going to go in it. Ginger and I are finally in for the night. Our 11 o'clock dinner didn't go so well because I don't think they were prepared for that many people. Ginger and I have a lot of curling irons and brushes and shoes. And shoes. And so one, two, three, four, five, six. I got seven. Seven. I got some in my suitcase. Oh, she hasn't even brought them all out. I think. Yeah, I can't tell. Oh, you have a band. I, I, I love those bands. You gonna work out? <laughs> yeah. And so I was like bringing my shoes out and Ginger's like, oh my God, I love you because you have a lot of shoes. And then when we got off the plane, I like had all this stuff. The girls were like, why didn't you pack a bag? And I'm like, oh, I pack as if they lose my bag because it happens all the time. But I mean, I checked a bag and I had the biggest bag <laughs> and we had to get our own taxi. And they act like we're high maintenance or something, but we're not. Like, we just like to have choices. I really like all the lighting here and that's part of our hotel over there and then look at city of dreams you see how all the lights it's just like really pretty like you just want to stare at it this down here reminds me of gaylord the conservatory and i think this is the clearest it's been since we've been here like it is so smog smoggy not foggy, but smoggy. And everyone here like this, from here, like a lot of people wear masks. And I could tell the air quality was not that great because when I got off the plane, I was coughing like I had a cough. It was crazy. But I just, I love these lights and how they, they really keep you engaged. It's a great use of marketing dollars for sure. Two things I learned today. Not suitable for work. NSFW? I'm like, what is that acronym? And people are like, you don't know what that is. I'm like, I've never heard of that before. The other one was R and D, which is rip off and duplicate. And so I think I might have a class named that because I think it's brilliant. Like that's like the wash, rinse, repeat GSD workshop that we do. Oh my gosh, I think I, I think I hear the Greatest Showman soundtrack, which makes me really excited. So when uh, EO asked me to come here, I was like, ah, I don't know. And then they said, Moss is coming. I was like, yeah, whatever, take my money. <laughs> so um, we want you. This year, the LAC region helped our Nicaraguan members deal with the crisis in their country. And the US and Canadian members came. This fast changing, digitally connected, Reimagine. These are all things that I honestly never would have uh, been able to solve had it not been for EO. I want to say that EO gave me my voice. Okay, what is up with the chair covers here in China? Look at all these chair covers. They're really bad. They're really ugly. And they're quite comfortable. Maybe chair covers are coming back. I don't know. Say hi, Jen. Hi. Jen just arrived. They didn't bring her luggage. Who are we talking to? There's Steve. Hello. Uh, do you like Steve or Steven? Steven. Steven. <laughs> That's like people try to call me Angie, and I'm Ew, like, who? What? That's so not what? me. Okay, bye. Okay, it's time for class. Class time. Right here.
I'm supposed to pass on this. Three-year mission to explore strange new cities. To seek out new cultures and new members. And to boldly go where no entrepreneur has gone before. It's still raining. I don't think it's gonna stop. This is the first time we've walked outside. You you said, look, look at this building amazing, right amazing, this amazing building amazing. with a hole in the middle look, and the lights, look the raining light. Oh my gosh, <laughs> these are beautiful. Flipping incredible. Holy and the way they have them wrapped, oh, it's beautiful. Beijing kitchen for dinner. Hi. We do. Yeah, an EO group, EO Nashville. Big group. Yes. Big group. <laughs> Look at that big My side side. comes right through. They're cooking a lot of noodles. And this is our board dinner. And I feel like I'm moving. <laughs> There's our president! Are we live? Oh, I love dry eyes! Oh, look at the dry eyes coming out over here. That's cool. needs to practice civility amongst our peers, our leaders, our staff. Now what else can we do to help nurture this type of nurturing mindset for our leaders? Of the individual. It's the common bond between us all. The challenge I find with this line is that you have to do this as what we call applied knowledge. So it is not enough in my book to just read the white papers or go to the conferences, you actually... Then you have a much better outcome in when the actual event happens. So again, this health and safety training allows for a gamified, immersive, and interactive learning experience. And as a raw code, some of it, it's these A's, T's, C's, and G's. You might have seen these kinds of DNA bases before. And um, the thing to note about this is that we've only recently developed technologies that have made it easy enough for us to... Oh my gosh, okay, so we're in Macau at the mall and you can get into the Apple store. It is incredible, it's beautiful. It's so pretty. Apparently, we have been told there are no lines, like you don't have to make an appointment or anything. So we're about to go in. Okay, it is two freaking stories. I've never been in a two stories Apple store. Oh my god. It's just not stopped raining since we've been here. And they've got the cute little cubes like we do in Nashville. Look at this training store in Macau at Apple. They have the huge learning wall like we do in Nashville. It is pouring outside. Have fast computers. The iPhone came out. Now, before you get too happy and complacent about this, let's say we meet here 10 years from today. We have extrapolated this curve exactly the same way to win. No, you didn't. I said I was. So you are a robot? No, my name is Cliverbert. Yes, you are a robot and you were named as Cliverbert. I am a robot. Yes, I know. Together we are robots. <laughs> I'm not a robot. I'm a unicorn. <laughs> It, it goes, the conversation goes on for hours, but the machines have no clue what they're talking about. So if, you, if, you, if your conversations with your customers sound like this, you're toast. You'll be replaced by an AI tomorrow. But if you have slightly more nuanced conversations with people, you're safe. Because AI, right now, we don't know how to do this. Now this is changing. Uh, it's, it's not just a question of data. We don't have the right mechanism for that campaign. And so you have to stay on this line and educate yourself by doing it because you want to be ready when the market hits. 
you want to have the muscle memory to actually execute. Look at this. Look at how. Look at the poor people in 2010 who thought they. It's interesting to see how AI was, and it's right now. Wozniak. This is at once, but <laughs> modern technology lets us beam up. Indeed. So as you can see, we're in the future, and we beam was into this room. And that is and the conference room. Pleasant party. I'm kind of digging this. Instead of drink, looks pretty cool. The lanterns are right in with the theme. Projection board in here. I think I like the red drink and the red lighting. Yeah, the red light's kind of sexy. Yeah. Isn't it? And it's that oh, disco ball everywhere. Say hi. Hey. The coolest guy here with the best Wi-Fi. The coolest guy right here standing in front of the camera. <laughs> We are on a boat. We're on a boat. 
that reminds me of it. It's a little skip from Macau to Hong Kong for a couple days. This water is so wavy and the waves are so huge. I am motion sick. I don't like boats. Ugh. I can't wait to get to Hong Kong. I have lots of stories to tell you guys about Macau when I get time. Yay! We finally, finally arrived! After a very, very, very bumpy whew, ferry ride. I got so sick, y'all. Like, so sick. But then we had pizza, <laughs> and it was amazing. And finally got into our room at Intercontinental. Let me show you. It's so cute. It's so pretty. Good carpet. Good decor. And bedding. Look at the bathroom. I love all this marble in Hong Kong. Cute shower. Okay, ready for my favorite part? And it's not the work table, people, okay? This is my favorite part. The harbor. Judith told us that it was worth the upgrade to get a harbor view room. Judith, I have to agree. But I did learn that this is all smog. It's not fog. I didn't realize how China was so polluted. I guess I understand why people wear a mask here. We are headed to some shopping type things where you like get fake things. I don't know. I'm not really into shopping, but I'm gonna go. Oh, it is. This is Temple Street. That's the night China? market event. What does Perhaps that mean? The night market is. I mean, we have until eight. The Hong Kong Jockey Club. Did you? We are at Jade Market. Okay, I'm kind of freaking out. Look at all this paper. And he's using a real typewriter. Like a real typewriter. Oh, I like it all. It's beautiful. Excuse me. This is crazy. Yeah. And all the clutter and all the paper. Oh my goodness. I just want to organize everything for them. These things are beautiful. I feel like they need a productivity day. I saw him in the store not long ago and I yeah. wanted to call him. And days. And days. Not to go to the ladies' market. Because that's where they have like fake Gucci. Now it's raining. 
We have no umbrella. So we're like stuck in this mark area. He's moving out. It's a very old, yes, very old trees. Yeah, very old. That's their name? No, <laughs> just trees. <laughs> Very old! <laughs> Very old trees! Steven, <laughs> are your hands clean? <laughs> oh You're the nicest cab driver. Say hi! Yeah. Hi! What is your name? My name, uh, you can call me uh, Timothy. <laughs> you look like a... <laughs> yes, I have a Christian name, you know. <laughs> Unbelievable, right? No. You, you look like a Timothy! <laughs> uh, <laughs> we just got back from the market and we are drenched. It rained and poured and it was crazy. And there's a light show going on where all the buildings coordinate their lights, which is pretty cool. It's a little smoggy, so you can't see it. That's very bumpy. But what's awesome is. This video is for you. So we finally found an amazing restaurant. I'm in the bathroom and the attention to detail in this Chinese restaurant is incredible. Like, I cannot even describe it. Like, first off, I thought water was gonna like come out of this. But this is the sink. And look at the attention to detail. On the drink, this specialty drink menu. It's not just any drink menu, it's the specialty drink menu. The food here is phenomenal. And I guess another one that we get again is just the attention to detail and the 48 inch ish round lazy Susan in the middle of the huge table that we're all eating at. So when you get off the elevator, we have this humongous tree with all these gorgeous, gorgeous lanterns. And the view of downtown Hong Kong is absolutely What's up? Oh yeah. Oh, it's a that part. <laughs> yeah, that never Cheers. happened. Here. This was our dinner view. Thanks to Leah from the Philippines. The most incredible restaurant, I think. And Good morning! We are headed to take a tour of Hong Kong today and I am so thankful 
because the smog is really low today in Hong Kong and it's not raining, but you see the clouds in the sky. So Intercontinental has us all prepared with a branded umbrella, of course. And I've been told it's like really curvy, so I'm slightly scared that I might get motion sick. So I have a puke bag. My medications, a hat, of course my phone charger, and water and a washcloth, just in case. Car sick. Gotta go prepared. At Hong Kong, we got a nickname. We call it the Pearl of the Orange, right? Oh, yeah. Yes, just remember, pearling is very dangerous. Oh, she's looking for someone else. Oh, uh, Shelfie. <laughs> all right. So, uh, do you have an itinerary? That's our tour all, guide. We We're will off. be across the Tad the smoggy up here. This is the beach in Hong Kong. The trees here are beautiful. Super old. Apparently, this sign means that if you want babies, it means fertility. It's so colorful and like so pretty. All these statues mean something. So colorful and so beautiful. There's trees! The bridge! Even though it is raining like crazy, we are still going to bear the tour. It's our last day in Hong Kong. This is the guy in charge of love and matrimony. These are the three rams. All of these statues symbolize something. The colors are so pretty. This is the Lions Club Pavilion of Hong Kong. Trees. What the fuck? <laughs> So WTF here means where's the food? And the thing that I think is awful is they have a dog parking area and there's a dog in the rain getting soaking wet. Hi little puppy. I'm so sorry that you're getting so wet. Okay, this is a hole in the floor and we're not using the bathroom in here. And I think- On the end there's two holes. I think it says no video because they don't want you to know how inhumane that is. It's called Repulse Bay. R E P U L S E B A Y. And that's. Here it's 
Snow Mountain, which is a famous place in the mall with a lot of dim stars. The shoes go to Lady Market. I would like to. I don't want to go. I don't really know what I'm reading, kind of, but the best thing is this. It has a barbecue. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. No, no, no. This is the longest escalator in the world. This is the old prison The rooms are like really small Look at these beautiful trees. I can just imagine the vertical lights hanging. Huh. When you're transporting things, there's lots of different wheels here. So it's like you can just go up and choose what kind of transportation system and cart system you need. <laughs> lots of options. But I'm honestly not certain. This tree is gorgeous. Oh. Okay, that is awesome. I don't know what kind of wall this is, but. Oh, this is a jewelry store. So what she say? This is where people come to pray. They people come here to pray. Yeah. The smoke. To the gods. Buddha. Look at how beautiful it is this evening. Finally, the smog has gone away just a little bit and the sun's coming out and it's beautiful.
Hong Kong last night. The pictures just don't do it justice. I did too. <laughs> we passed that to Barbara. Behind yeah. the scenes. Check this out. Shopping on our cool. With nuts and bullets. Lots of cheap belts and Supreme hats. I don't know what that means. 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 Oh, we have more. I forgot. Oh, we have more. Oh, we got this and little. And wait, there's more. What, is, what brand is this? Longchamp. A Longchamp for my daughter. It's a little backpack. Oh.